video you know um did part one a few days ago we'll hit up part two so let's get into it y'all we have the covenant chronicle The Facility, I was actually pleasantly surprised by this. It was a really good independent film through Tribeca. The Silent House with Elizabeth Olsen. Shutter Island. Sanitarium, it's actually a really good anthology movie with Malcolm McDowell, it was really good. The Lazarus Effect. I got this for Christmas a few years back. <laughs> Woodshop. It's quite a macabre movie. Cube. Secret Window. Another copy of Hell House LLC. Blair Witch 1 and 2 Duo Pack. The official sequel to the Blair Witch Project. The Killing of a Sacred Deer. This movie has the weirdest dialogue of any movie I've ever seen. Like, they talk like nobody else in the world. 28 Days Later. 28 Weeks Later. Return of the Living Dead. I need to upgrade that. I've had that for a while. <clears throat> Dead and Deader. I got this at Family Video for the clothes. <clears throat> Zombie Nation. I just got this for past year for Christmas. It's a Moggy. <laughs> In the Flesh, Season 1. In the Flesh, Season 2. The first season of The Walking Dead. Nice post-apocalyptic movie, The Road. M. Night Shyamalan's The Happening. Invasion of the Body Snatchers. The Invasion with Nicole Kidman. The Stepford Wise with Nicole Kidman. <clears throat> Scarface. My father got that for me about 10 or 12 years ago through Columbia House. Dog Day Afternoon. Father gave me that one too. Oh, get in the hole. There we go. Kind of awkward angle, y'all. New Jack City. Yeah. 
Goodfellas, one of my favorite movies ever. The Outsiders. The Godfather Collection. The 15th anniversary of Reservoir Dogs without the little gas can. Kill Bill Volume 1. And Kill Bill Volume 2. True Romance Ultimate Director's Cut. Collector's Edition of Pulp Fiction with the Jackrabbit Slims menu. Mm. There we go. Collector's edition of Jackie Brown. Cabin Fever. Death Proof, one of my all time favorite movies. A la Plot de Mort, which means Death Proof, which also is in the chant that Charles Lee Ray talks in the beginning of Child's Play when he transfers to the doll. A little bit of stuff right there. Hostel. Hostel 2. And Glorious Bastards. Dirty Dancing. It's missing its little thing. I got this in that box of movies that I got that had a bunch of movies in it. Ghost. A Passion of the Christ. Immortals. The Director's Cut of Troy. Four K Ultra HD version of Godzilla vs Kong. This is my wife's movie. This is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles collection. She loves the turtles, y'all. Loves the turtles. Justice League Zack Snyder cut in four K. It's got a great Dolby Atmos track too. Man of Steel. Joaquin Phoenix's Joker. Two film collection, The Suicide Squad, and The Birds of Prey. I was a little let down on Birds of Prey, but it's not a bad movie. I'm not going to knock it, though. Watchmen, Director's Cut. Definitely a movie you do not knock. Also a Zack Snyder film. Thor. The Avengers, Age of Ultron, and the Avengers. The Hunger Games Collection. And just the Hunger Games. Winter's Bone. Get Smart. Real good movie with Dwayne, Dwayne The Rock Johnson and Billy Bob Thornton. Faster. It's a real good revenge movie. If you ain't seen it, give it a look. Killer Elite with Jason Statham. Crank. I still need to get a hold of Crank 2 High Voltage. I think it's better than the first one. Homefront. That was a good surprise. That was a good movie. Yeah, this one's for Night Watch. Flying Fists of Kung Fu. 12 movie collection. Nice old school Kung Fu theater. 
Hitman Unrated Edition. The Star Wars Saga 1 through 6. I'm not going to bash the other ones, but I'll probably never own any of them. Maybe Part 7. Because that one was actually pretty good. Dread. A collector's edition of James Cameron's Avatar. For a real nice, cool, cool bookcase type, type case here. Comes out. You got your pictures and everything, you see? Yeah, it got this little slide thing where the movies stay. Different pictures of the film and such. Uh, the first disc is all the different cuts in the movie. And the other two discs are just full of just special features. This movie's got special features galore, man. Special effects, behind the scenes, commentary, um, interviews. If you care about that kind of stuff, it is full of that. Blu-ray, DVD, digital copy of Titanic. I really want to see a 4K of that, though. I think it'd be real pretty. A three-pack of Arnold Schwarzenegger movies. Commando, Predator, and The Terminator. Yeah. Get to the chopper right now. Extreme DVD edition of Terminator 2. Um, for those of you that have the Blu-ray, the Skynet edition, I've been trying to activate my Skynet edition now for a while, and I can't seem to get the Skynet cut to work. So if y'all could help me out in the comments on that. Hilary Swank and Jeffrey Dean Morgan and The Resident, which is also one of Christopher Lee's, like, 2,000 appearances. Fight Club. There are three rules of Fight Club. P2. I was pleasantly surprised by that one, too. Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring. It is the only Lord of the Rings movie I have. But I do like all of them. They're just long as hell. City of Angels, Michael, two-pack. Gotcha. RSVP. Mark Wahlberg, a rock star. Jennifer Aniston. The remake of The Fan with Robert De Niro and Wesley Snipes. Pretty good movie. I dig that one. The Wrestler. This one's got a lot of personal connections with it. Um, you know, if my father was a professional wrestler. And there's other underlying story aspects of that movie that are quite personal. Rocky wanted two. Two packs. Rocky 3 and 4 two-pack. As far as I am concerned, those are the only Rocky movies that need to be. Rocky 1 through 4. I'm not bashing 5 or Rocky Balboa. I love the Creed movies, but as far as I'm concerned, Rocky 1 through 4 is the only Rockies that needed to be made. But that being said, this came in a box full of movies, like I said before, it's Rocky Balboa. It wasn't bad. I remember going to the theater to see that. The Rambo Trilogy, one through three. The Pursuit of Happiness and a blockbuster case, y'all. That's awesome. You don't see a lot of those no more. So if I find a DVD with a blockbuster symbol on it, I typically like to pick it up. Enemy of the State. Mississippi Burning. A 
license to kill. Absolute power. Pretty decent movie. Mystic River. I got this for Christmas a couple years back as well. Decent movie. On a sling blade. Mm -hmm. Billy Bob Thornton. Mm -hmm. Love the French fried taters. Mm -hmm. Mr. Brooks. The League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. The 50th anniversary of the Diary of Anne Frank. I also have the actual Diary of Anne Frank. The actual book. Here's the TV BBC edition of Diary of Anne Frank. Found this at Family Dollar. It's a John Wayne McClintock collection. The Quiet Man. My favorite John Wayne movie. Night of the Hunter. A Hard Day's Night. Dropping down the shelf three, no, shelf four. We got Breakfast at Tiffany's. Big Audrey Hepburn fan. As you can see here, I got her seven movie collection right here. We got Breakfast at Tiffany's, Funny Face, My Fair Lady, Paris When It Sizzles, Roman Holiday, Sabrina, and Warren Peace. Actor, excellent actor. Classic. Wizard of Oz. Juno. Jodie Foster in the Panic Room. An old super bit. Foxfire with Angelina Jolie. Jawbreaker. Aquino Lover. Burning Bed. Fair Fawcett. Boys Don't Cry with Hilary Swank. Fantastic movie. True story. So is the Burning Bed. Fantastic movie, well acted. Click, also from Blockbuster. Mr. Deeds. Billy Madison. Uh, one of mine and my wife's favorite movies is 50 First Dates. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. Me and Gore agreed that it probably have to be like the greatest title of a movie ever. I wish I could have came up with it first. Epic Movie. Vampires Suck. The Dukes of Hazard. Turn it up, center stage. Meet the Spartans. Oh, funny ass movie right there. Here's a good classic for y'all. Willy Wonka and a Chocolate Factory. It's good stuff right there. Transylvania, six five thousand from the Midnight Madness series. Fast Times at Ridgemont High. 
and my stand-up comedy. We got Ron White, a little unprofessional, which I think is his best stand-up. Bill Cosby himself. Eddie Murphy's Delirious. Eddie Murphy's Raw. Cat Williams, Cat House Comedy. Saturday Night Live Collection, The Best of Chris Farley. That was a funny ass dude. The Cold Case Files Collection of the most infamous cases. It comes with One Night on a Bong You, Killer in the County, Frozen in Time, A Map to Murder, The Zodiac Killer, The Green River Killer, The Weepy Voice Killer. I didn't mean to kill that girl. I'm gonna kill myself, I think. The Lady Killer, Kidnapped and Love Triangle. Those are all very good stories right there. And then I got Most Evil, which I think is one of the best crime TV shows ever. Manson, 1972 documentary, recorded while Manson and the girls from the Tate and LaBianca killings were in prison awaiting trial. Jonestown, Paradise Lost, which is one of my favorite docudrama type movie, movies into series almost done show we got one more one more shelf to go Michael Landon Highway to Heaven season one Little House on the Prairie season four love Little House on the Prairie y'all the Jeffersons, season one and two. That's actually a Shout Factory release. I didn't know that. Charlie's Angels, season one. Love Charlie's Angels. Night Gallery, season one and two. Oz, season one. Oz season two, Oz season three, Oz season four, Oz season five, and hey, don't forget, Oz season six. He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. Beavis and Butthead, The Mike Judge Collection, Volume 1, Disc 2. I lost the other ones to this, though. Somebody stole them. Sword Art Online, Seasons 1 and 2. I did not like Alkazation. Typo Negative, Symphony for the Devil. That That's a real good concert. That was from the Bazaar Festival. Michael Jackson number ones, music video compilation DVD, Journey, his greatest hits DVD, with Steve Perry, of course. We Are the World, story behind the song. It's a good little behind the scenes documentary type thing. Guns and Roses, welcome to the videos. Frosty the Snowman, Santa Claus is coming to town, Emmett Otter's Jug Band Christmas, yeah I grew up watching this every year for Christmas, every year, we didn't miss an Emmett Otter, the Peanuts Deluxe Collection, a Charlie Brown Christmas, and last but not least, 
we got enough with Jennifer Lopez. Y'all, that shelf two, that is um, basically the end of my movie collection. I have some videotapes and some wrestling DVDs. I'll probably make a whole nother video for those. They're on another shelf. But thank you guys for you know watching my videos, liking my videos, subbing to me. Appreciate you guys. Really helped the channel grow and everything, you know. Go check out Gorephobe. Go look at Nightwatch Zone. You know, go 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 check out Johnny Walker. Um much love to all three of y'all. I love you guys. Have a nice night. This is Drake and Kane. You've been watching Drake and Kane's channel. Sleep sweet, you guys.